This memorial here outside the Independence Police Station has grown tremendously since Thursday night. What started out as a way to honor Officer Cody Allen has now grown to honor civil process surfer Drexel Mack as well. After a vigil held on Friday night, they put up this heart. People can come, sign their names, and offer their condolences for Drexel Mack's family. Speaking of his family, I had the chance to sit down with them earlier today. There were laughter, there were tears, but ultimately, we talked about what they're doing to keep his memory alive. Drexel Mack's family says he was born to serve. He always wanted to be a police. Yeah. Always. Law enforcement. Always. What I keep playing in my head is how happy he was when he started this job. But he loved his family just as much. We all looked up to him. He was an amazing man to us, a role model. A role model they didn't expect to lose. He was just doing his job. Nobody expected an eviction to go this crazy. Just days later, they're still processing this loss. It's unreal still. It's like hitting in waves. And it's not just hitting in Kansas City. We have family across seas. Like, this is in the Bahamas and Virginia and Miami, Maryland, like, all over. They're leaning on each other to get through and finding comfort in memories. He was so good for this world. He had a voice out of this world. <laughs> he made me watch all, all the Scar movies, uh, Saw movies in one night. Didn't like that. <laughs> <laughs> he was a great big brother, a great father. Beyond memories, they're left with questions. Why would you shoot? I'm not understanding it. As they wait for answers, they're making peace with what they do know. They're doing something that he loves. Rachel Henderson, KSHB 41 News.